What's up everybody, hope you're all doing great. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good evening already, at least where I'm from. And welcome to this video in which we will uh, talk about Ethereum Classic, uh, more ETC, let's see abbreviation. Um, yeah, I just wanted to cover it today because I, I, I thought it was relatively bullish. It's, it's not even that bullish. Um, it's up 5%, volume is, is amazing, over 1 billion. Um, that is really amazing. It's 22% of the market capital. So if you compare it with other cryptos, uh, 1 billion is higher than Solana, XRP, Cardano, BNB. It's, it's higher than all of those big ones. Um, it's in the top six. Uh, and apart from that, it's, it's going to be interesting what's going to happen with ETC um, when the whole merge happens from Ethereum, uh, because then ETC will be the only proof of work Ethereum, um, which will uh, further distinguish it, um, even though its whole culture and, and the code has been dis or is distinguished from uh, Ethereum as we know it. Um, so that's going to be interesting. And apart from that, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm rambling a li little bit too much. We'll, we'll get into the analysis very quickly, but I also wanted to uh, get back into my rhythm. All right, because I always did like 10 to 12 videos last couple of days. It was around six to eight uh, and I got it back uh, got got to get that back up again. So that's also why I'm doing this. I'm posting three videos after this as well. Uh, so check those out if you if you have time. Um, if we take a look at the Ethereum Classic, though, what you can see is that when we had that whole bearish drop, we drop down to the support level here between um, between $32, but I, I should actually extend this a little bit, I think. So we're just going to do that right now in this video. Um, because what we actually did, I think we should drag it all the way like 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 this, maybe like this. Uh, like, like, yeah, this is the very maximum we can extend it to. Um, so we broke all the way down to that uh, support level. And what we did today, and, th and that's the main reason also why I'm covering this, as I said, we're relatively bullish. Um, but we also got a, a bullish breakout right here. We br broke out out of this 3A2 FIP uh, together with that whole key level and that 3A2 uh, and, and, and the uh, 50 EMA, that red line. Um, so I think that's pretty interesting. If we zoom into the one hour time frame, you can see that we're just reacting to it right now. Um, and, and this is kind of risky for me to say uh, because we have hit another resistance level. Um, but I think Ethereum Classic is actually, it, th this move actually signals enough strength uh, for me to say that I think we're going up higher. I think we'll take a break retest off of this whole level between $36 and $35. Um, and I think we can reach all the way up to this level right here, uh, around $38 and uh, $38.5. From there, I do expect quite a sharp drop unless we get some very bullish fundamentals. Uh, but still, it's, it's a bullish move. Um, uh, maybe we can delete this. I'm not sure yet. Let's delete it. Um, so yeah, I'm expecting a little bit more bullishness from uh, from ETC uh, up to a price target of around $38. I think $38 is going to be it. Um, but after, after that, I do expect to drop down to $35 again and down towards that $33, $32 level. And uh, from there, we'll have to see again. I'll probably update it very, uh, for, very soon too. I think that's important, definitely for a coin such as Ethereum Classic. Uh, so for now, that's my analysis. If you have any questions about the analysis or you want to discuss that, uh, feel free to. I'm always open for that um, in, the in the comments. But for now, I'd like to thank you all for watching and listening. Take care, and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.